How to use credit cards. If you have your first credit card, congratulations! Credit cards have a lot of benefits to them. They allow you to purchase things without paying right away, giving you more financial freedom. If used responsibly, they allow you to boost your credit score, which will pay off down the line when you go to make a big purchase or ask for a loan to make that purchase. Also, many credit cards have reward systems that give you cash back on certain, if not all, purchases. Just like credit cards have benefits, they also have drawbacks and downsides. If you aren't able to pay off your credit card statements at the end of a month, your credit score will sink and you will incur penalties, placing you more and more in debt. Using credit cards responsibly is a top priority. In this guide, we will discuss how to use credit cards. Watch your spending. Keep track of your expenses. Just because you can buy something doesn't mean you should. Make sure you know what you're spending money on and don't let your credit card bills rack up without keeping track of what you've spent. A new pair of shoes here, a daily round of drinks there, it adds up over time and you don't want to get sticker shock at the end of the month. A good rule of thumb is to keep enough track of your spending that you are not shocked at the end of the month by the number on the statement. Pay your credit card time. Paying on time is a no-brainer. It is key to ensuring that your credit score stays above water and you don't incur penalties. That is why you shouldn't spend more than you have and pay things off as quickly as possible. Once you get your paycheck, pay off your credit card. That should be priority one, or at least high on the list. Maximize repayments. Repay as much as you can whenever you can. Don't be afraid to just pay things off, even if they are not due yet. Is this the most fun way to spend the extra cash? No. But it is the most responsible and has the best payoff later on. It's all about the big picture. Don't use credit cards as a last resort. If you're barely making ends meet, this is not a solution to that. A credit card will give you very temporary reprieve, but you will have to pay it off. It's just a matter of time and how much, as credit card companies charge fees for late payment. It's better to deal with your money problems a different way, rather than use this as a life raft, because it is not one. Check statements frequently. Always check your card statements. Not just because you want to track what you're spending money on, but also to make sure that no one has stolen your card or that you're not paying fraudulent fees. Credit card theft is, unfortunately, real, and if you don't check your statement, you could be paying for things you never purchased. Set a responsible limit. You don't need a $10,000 daily credit card limit. Set a responsible, sensible limit on your credit card, and avoid hitting the limit whenever possible. A credit card with a low limit of credit will keep you from going overboard and overextending yourself. Take advantage of rewards. The fun part about credit cards is that a lot of them have rewards to them. When you apply, you should take a look at the different rewards options that each offer. Often, there is a cashback system. Some even have a point or cash bonus just for signing up. Remember that your credit score matters when applying for a card. Often, the credit cards that have the most rewards require the highest credit. If you are accepted, however, make sure to take advantage of the cashback at the end of the year. You can use that to pay off debt or spend on something fun. These rules of thumb will help you maximize your credit utility and minimize any drawbacks to having a credit card, including downsides to your credit score. You want to make sure that you're spending wisely and paying things off properly. Ready to become a credit card expert? Learn everything you need to know about credit cards with our Credit Cards 101 series. Ready to get started? Here's what you need to know. Credit Card Basics Credit Card April How do minimum payments and late fees for credit cards work? Credit Card Fees and How to Avoid Them Credit Card Grace Periods Types of Credit Cards Credit card balance transfer cards. Balance transfer checks. Understanding cashback credit cards. Should you sign up for store credit cards? 
What are the best credit cards to build credit? What are the easiest credit cards to get approved for? Credit card how-tos. How to increase your credit limits. What to do if you lose your credit card. How to cancel a credit card. How to get rid of old credit cards.